What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High, Priest High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs. Cuts through side to everybody, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys. If you'd like to donate, type Priestess to Row 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only. No cash up. No Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. Love you guys so much. Uh, thanks for all the new subscribers. And if you'd like to book a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. Um, and I offer a new service called per, uh, Life Coaching if anybody's interested in that. Okay, so um, I received another channel message. I hope everybody's doing well. They're just flying in today, so we're just going to keep doing it. Um, just saying, just saying. Okay, so the channel message I received was a, um, a water sign um, energy, some masculine, some feminine. Um, uh, of your past, I heard for some, they were above you um, um, in the workplace. For some, they were highly above you in the work, uh, workplace. Um, however that resonates and applies. So you were subordinate to them. Um, so for some, I feel they may have been like one ranking, one echelon above you. For some, several rankings or echelons above you. You know, what? however that resonates. Um, but they you knew this person of the past in a workplace, whether it's a masculine or femme water sign. Um, I heard they want to come back. They want to come back now and they want to work with you. I heard for some, they are retired. For some, they are not. For some, they have gotten terminated. Um, but they want to, they want to come back and work with you. For some, offer you a position. For some, a business opportunity. I heard it would not be smart because of the past they betrayed you in a huge way. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Uh, there's a lot going on there and it's heavy water sign energy. <clears throat> how that resonates and applies, uh, masculine or feminine. I'm down like this because of the glare. So just saying. So um, so you plug it in, how it resonates. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, above you energy, whether it was one ranking above you, several above you, whatever, whatever, whatever. I'm feeling like they could have been like a manager, boss, supervisor, CEO. Um, however, they were above you either a little bit or a lot, okay? Uh, for some, they could have been like executive directors or something of that nature, possibly. I didn't hear that, but they either were a little bit above you or a lot above you. Um, for some, they have been terminated. For some, they have retired. For some, they're still in the workplace. Um, but they have severely betrayed you in the past, severely. Uh, I heard it wouldn't, the spiritual download in that is it wouldn't be smart. It wouldn't be smart. So, of course, you have the free will to accept but the spiritual download in that is it wouldn't be smart. Um, so, and the thing is, if they're going to betray you one time, they're going to betray you again. And that's just the truth. If you might need to hear that. If they're going to betray you one time, they will betray you again. If it benefits them. Usually. Usually. Not all people. Some people truly do change, but a lot don't. When it comes to benefiting their pocketbooks or themselves or to getting themselves up. And that's just the truth. And I think for a lot of you guys, they used you as like a scapegoat or a punching bag type energy, not a physical punching bag, but like a metaphorical scapegoat type energy to get themselves up in the rankings. Um, and I'm just, I'm serious about that. So of course you have free will to do it, but spiritual download was, it would be smart to do it. For some, it's business opportunities they're going to uh, attempt to offer you. For some, it is, um, they want to work with you in the workspace. So, um, you plug it in how it resonates. Masculine or feminine, water sign, energy, cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Okay? Now, of course, hopefully you guys can identify who these people are. And when they start trying to come back and offer you business opportunities or, um, or to come back, work at the workplace, wherever the workplace was, or whatever, 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 I would hope you'd be able to identify these people. Uh, but heavy water sign, energy, cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, energy. Um, masculine or feminine. All right, let's pull some cards. I heard 
for some they've been terminated, for some they have retired, and for some they're in they're still in the workplace. So of course, you know, when they come back, if it was me, I'd be asking a lot of questions. I'd be asking a lot of questions. Well, are you still in the workplace? Um, and you know, they can answer you. Well, no, I was terminated, or if they are if they're honest, if they're honest, oh, I was terminated, or I'm retired, or I'm still working there, or whatever, whatever, whatever. Whether it's a business opportunity or they're trying to get you to come back. Okay? Spirit messages here for collectives. I heard take it. We have leadership. Number 39 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 39, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number. Number 39, stag spirit leadership. For some, you could be earth signs possibly or have earth in your chart. Because stag, stag spirit is our sign energy. Or not. You plug it in how it resonates. Some of these people were so threatened of you in the past. Because they saw huge leadership qualities there. Huge leadership qualities. But now they're in regret because... Of life events that have happened to them. This would not be a smart idea. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So if this resonates for you, um, whether you have earth in your chart or not, um, they saw you as a huge threat. So they did all these, uh, they did shiesty behind the scenes. Like, whoever you are, I feel they probably tried to sabotage you, or they did sabotage you. There was huge sabotage here in the past. Huge. They regret it now. Some have already experienced huge karma. More are about to. Okay, that's confirmation. So there was huge sabotage here. There was. That's confirmation. There was huge sabotage here in the past. They were jealous of you. They were jealous of you. They were threatened of you because they saw the huge leadership skills in you in the past. They didn't want you to be a leader. They didn't want you to come up with them. They wanted to use you for their come up so they could be seen as the leader, as the um, the the top prize, the top doll, like control and dominance tactics, basically. So they didn't want you. It's not like they were it's not like helping each other to come up. It's like they were just using you as a footstool to come up because they, God forbid, you be seen as a leader, too. You see what I'm saying? But cycles have changed for these people. Some of them, they've gotten terminated. For some, they have retired. And for some, they still work there. But things are not going well for them. So they want, now they want you to come back. Now they want you to come back either for a business opportunity or, um, or to come back into the workplace to help them. But they didn't want the, your leadership skills to be seen in the past because they were threatened of you. They were threatened of you, of your leadership's qualities, and they saw the leadership qualities in the past. So, of course, you have free will to do this. It's upcoming. They haven't reached out to you yet, this water sign boss of the past, uh, whether one ranking above you or five or six rankings above you, whether a manager, boss, supervisor, CEO, executive director, or whatever, whatever. They haven't reached out to you yet, but just know they saw your leadership qualities in the past, and that's why, and I heard there was huge sabotage there. So they sabotaged you in the past because they didn't want you to be seen as a leader. They didn't want you to be seen as a leader because they wanted, they wanted it all, but in a dark way with sabotage. You can choose to work with these people. Um, whoever, for some, I feel it's one person coming back. For some, it feel, I feel it could be several. Um, for some, it is one. For some, it is many. Okay, this confirmation. For some of you guys, it is one water sign, boss, or a person above you, or whatever, whatever, of the past. For some, it was, it's many. And for one of you, the person was on your same ranking when you knew this person. Okay, and for one, this person was of the same ranking as you when you knew this person. For some of you guys, they were one above you. For some, they were many but above you. For some, they were on the same level playing field um, as you in the workspace when you knew them. But th they were threatened of you. They were threatened of you. They didn't want you to know they were threatened of you. They saw the leadership in you in the past, but now so much shit is 
you it sounds like you separated your energy you went on to different things different areas you moved away from this some one person some two or two plus people now they want you they now they want you to come back this really would not be smart really would not wait out for the one for the one for one for some ones new people they see leadership in you too you're an excellent leader an excellent leader okay so you plug it in how it resonates so the uh, spiritual download in that was um it'd be smart not to go back to the people of your past basically apparently for some of you guys it's one person that sees huge leadership a new person new to you person that sees huge leadership in you for some it's two two plus that sees huge leadership in you i heard it'd be smart to wait out for the new ones it'd be smart to wait out for new ones for some it could be earth sign new earth sign possibly because we have earth sign energy in here for some maybe not but the spiritual download in that would be smart to basically leave all your people your past of whether they were on the same playing field as you in the workplace one ranking above you in the workplace or many rankings above you in the workplace leave them behind and basically go towards the new people um somebody sees leadership uh, quality and skills in you whoever you are i didn't hear a sign on you you have to plug yourself in where you fit whether it's um one new person that sees this or two or two plus okay you plug it in how it resonates all right i'm closing this out oh well, i feel got to get one more I'll get, I'll get one more these water signs want you back for strategic reasons know this okay i heard the water signs want you back for strategic reasons know this so you plug it in how it resonates yeah renewal they want to renew Number 20 could be very significant number in one's life. They want to re they want to reconcile. Uh, but for strategic reasons. Because I think bad shit's happened to them since you've left, is what I think. I didn't hear that, but that's my intuitive logic and reasoning. I think they've experienced towers in their own life. They were so busy beating you down and making you look like you wasn't a leader and like you were shit on a shoe and they were just a shiznit that they have experienced negative harm in their own life. So now they want you back. They want to reconcile. But I heard the spiritual download in that is it wouldn't be smart. Of course, you can go back if you want, but it wouldn't be smart because you've got wonderful things coming towards you. Number 31 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 31, you'd be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number. Number 31. Uh, but you've got miracles coming towards you. You've got miracles coming towards you, baby. Um, and it's in the form of one, I think, for some, I feel you're entrepreneurs. I didn't hear that. I just intuitively feel that you're entrepreneurs. You're entrepreneurs. And you are self-motivated, self-driving. Like, okay, so they didn't want you in the past. They sabotaged you in the past. You moved on. You took that lick and you moved on, as anybody should. You don't want to be disrespected in a workplace. And these people disrespected you, these uh, water signs, whether they were on the same level and playing field as you, one above you or many above you. They disrespected you to the highest, basically. All because they wanted to look like the shiny soul. Well, that's not how it's a, it energetically works in the universe and when you do that eventually it backfires on you and i think it's backfired on them so for some of you guys it's one new person that sees leadership and leadership qualities and skills and etc 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 and you for some it's two and two plus if it was me i'd hold out for the new people and just keep doing your thing keep doing you uh dig into your entrepreneurial skills um uh, your creativity um, doing whatever you're doing away from these water signs, uh, whether they were on the same echelon as you or above, workplace people in your past, and just keep moving forward because miracles are coming towards you. Of course, you can take the advice or leave it. You are an amazing person, amazing person. These people know they metaphorically shot themselves in the foot. They have they are receiving heavy negative karma. But you keep moving forward because so many new people see your potential, they see your worth. You keep going. 
Beautiful blessings are coming to you. Beautiful blessings. Well, there you go. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Okay. So um, you, okay, so spiritual download in that is just keep going. Keep moving forward. Keep going. Because so many people see your leadership skills, whether it's one person new to you um, or is about to see them or two or two plus that already sees them or is about to see them. Um, keep moving forward, baby, because positive miracles are coming for you, whether you know they are or not. You're a wonderful leader. You've proven it in the past, so much so, you had these water signs threatened of your ass, sabotaging you in the past, causing negative power moments for you, just so they can look good. But really, it's, and I heard it has backfired. It's backfired upon them, and they've received negative powers in their life. Well, that's what happens when you sabotage people. Eventually, the energy boomerangs back. But now they want you back. So, the advice in that was to keep moving forward. There's going to be positive miracles for you. Um, I Here's my intuitive logic and reasoning take on this. You can take it or leave it. I feel if you go back to these water signs, it's going to make you look bad. I feel it's going to make you look bad because they sabotaged you in the past. They were so threatened of you, so jealous of you in the past. They sabotaged you. So to the point, they sabotaged you in the past. They were so threatened and jealous of you. But if you go back to them, it degrades your worth and your value. You don't want to ever want to degrade, degrade your worth and your value. You let them lay in the bed that they uh, that they made, basically. Um, and you keep going forward because positive miracles are coming for you. That's the way I look at it. Of course, and you can reconcile with them if you want to. But um, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Okay? Of course, you can take the advice or leave it. I love you guys. I'm done. Um, if you think anyone else will like this channel or the videos and you think anyone else will benefit from the channel or the videos, please feel free to share them on social media and word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. I'm a single mom of two kids. And yes, I don't have full custody of my kids right now, but it doesn't mean I don't love them anymore. Okay. Love you guys so much. Everybody have a good day and namaste.